Okay, let's look at a, a few more examples on slope and y-intercept. Uh, how to graph from just knowing the, the slope and y-intercept. Okay, so the first thing is uh, figure out okay what it is. So remember the equation, uh, y, the equation y equals mx plus b. Okay, so this is your equation. And so your m is the one next to the variable. So m is equal to negative one half. And your y-intercept is your negative three. Or s sometimes we say the b. Okay, so that's my uh, two points that I need. You're gonna start on negative three. So start at negative three, you got a point there. And from there, you're gonna use your rise over run. So your rise over run is your slope. So I'm gonna put here one over negative two. Now I could have made the numerator negative and made the denominator positive, okay? Uh, the only reason I did that is because I have more space on top of the graph. So I wanna go up. So I made the one positive, so I'm gonna go up. And the two is negative, so I'm gonna go to the left, okay? And so I'm gonna start my uh, graphing my, my points with the slope. So from here, from the y-intercept, negative three, we're gonna start, okay, one and then two to the left. And I can keep going, so you can see one and two to the left. One and two to the left, okay? And you can make more points. And that's how you would graph using the slope and the y-intercept. Let's do one more here. Okay, that one's good. Okay, let's look at that one there, okay? Same thing, uh, don't forget your, uh, this is the same thing as your equation, y, M, y equals mx plus b, okay? Your m next to the variable, so it's one third. Uh, your b or your y-intercept is negative two, okay? It's the number to the far end, okay? Like I said, sometimes it's called the y-intercept, but I'll just put b this time. Uh, we put the point, start with this one here, negative two. So we put negative two here. And from there, we're gonna do the rise over run. Don't forget the rise over run. Okay, one over three. They're both positive, so one's going up, and this one's going to the right. And so starting here, you start uh, plotting the points. So one, and then one, two, three. You can do it again, one, one, two, three, okay? Once you have your points, well, you connect your line. Okay, and this is how you graph um, linear equations with the slope and y-intercept. Hopefully this helps. Adios, tengo buen día.